that is actually what more well. I was looking out. I was down in um, on the Solent on the weekend. Yes, I saw you were out and sailing. Saw saw some like uh, the little Lauren and I boats out and about. Very cute. Hope you were wearing your life jacket. I was. I was. <laughs> So like the rules of the boat that I was on, that you're not allowed, there was two main rules. The rule number one was you're not allowed on the boat with, you know, without, once it's, once it's off the off the moorings, you have to have your life jacket on until it's moored up again. Second rule, no alcohol until the same really, until you've moored up and, uh, and got it down. I'm liking this boat. So that was, that was the rule of the boat. Stacy. All right, you then got it. Then you rescuing by the RNLI. Well, this is the point. So stay safe on the seas. But I do love your mask. The Thank you very much. R and I dedicated <laughs> mask is. And has one Because how, how long have you been kind of with the R and I now? Forty-five years. Forty-five years. <laughs> Forty years to be fair. I was uh, <laughs> didn't have much choice when I was in the pram, but <laughs> <laughs> from about five when I was doing sailing. That's amazing, though. I mean, like as you say, for that. Dedication for that length of time, yeah. but I must admit, I mean, that, well, that's the thing. Push on. I mean, I think most people don't realise that it is it is charity run. I think they think you know the government must kind of like contribute something to yes. it, but it's all kind of it all relies right. fully on volunteers yeah. manning the stations and and the people kind of like donating money to keep them all going. Absolutely, the only stations that are paid are on the Thames. Uh, because they have to do 12 hour shifts, they have to launch within 90 seconds from the pager going off to actually being there. So we do have to pay people to, to be there and take time off work. But everybody else has to drop their work and run to a station. So it's pretty much as a siren goes off and the telephone yes. goes, but be in there. Because what's that? Because they've got, they've got to be in there with a certain period of time, haven't they? So on, on average, from the pager going off to, to being in the lifeboat station launching the lifeboat is kind of 10 to 15 minutes but like I say on the Thames things are a lot more critical so it's 90 seconds for them. Jeez. Which is just amazing to imagine you're asleep and then you're like 90 seconds you're awake <laughs> you're dressed in your full kit and you're off on the boat. Yeah see I, I would not be fully conscious <laughs> yeah. in 90, in 90 seconds <laughs> if you're lucky I can find my shoes at that sort of like level of consciousness it's amazing they can get going so quick though. Let's move this one. Excellent. Looking forward to this one. Oh, here we go. Floppy, floppy, floppy. Beautiful. One down. Beautiful. Look at that bit. But no, they do amazing work. I mean, I think that. I mean, that's like the. I mean, the program that's been on the BBC. That was it. Saving, saving lives at sea. On the BBC Two. I think that's done a really good job at kind of creating awareness of what the RNLI does and the people behind it, and not just yeah. the. The people on the boats with the support network that goes behind it, the volunteers <laughs> that put in put in hours and hours on their weekends, <laughs> standing with a bucket and breaking their backs and then needing some chiropractic to fix it. Well, this is it, you know. <laughs> Can we just fix it? Yeah? And it all works. <laughs> it's amazing. Though. I mean, the stories that you hear, though, I mean, it's because like people who don't. I mean, there's both kind of like collect. There's a lot more than I do. I've got very part time, but. But it's the, it's the stories that you hear when you're kind of collecting. That everybody that comes in that puts that money in the bucket normally has a story about either they were like rescued by the RNLI or they know somebody that was rescued by the RNLI. Yeah. Even in land, which you know you'd expect people at the sea to kind of know about lifeboats, but even in land, so many people are so generous because they've had experience. Or, like right. I say, you know, somebody that's been rescued. Amazing. I mean, because it's what? Cause it's, I mean, there's so many miles of coastline. Cause how, cause is it about, about three, how, many, how many lifeboat stations are there? Is that, is that 300 or so? Yes. It's I can't quite, remember. I mean, there's, a, there's, a, there's a lot. You can Google it. it. <laughs> Go on the RNLI website. <laughs> but yeah. I can't, I can't remember exactly. I can't remember if it's, if it's the same number of days the, the, yeah, the year. Like 360. Like 270. Yeah, or it's like half or whatever it is. I'll get hold of it. I'll roll you forward on this one. Right, here we go, breath on in. Oh, beautiful. And another one, breath in. Beautiful. Let's check the jaw as well. Push back that way. Both sides today. 
too much talking. It must be that. All, all the talking over the weekend. Work my way on in. Dig my way. You surviving? Yeah. Just working to the muscles of the the jaw, main, mainly the master. Just the main muscle of mastication, which opens and closes the mouth. All that, all that talking is, you see. <laughs> working, working to them. Just working my way across them. And then what we'll do is we'll stretch them out. And okay. it'll feel a lot easier then. Plus I won't be digging in, which will be much more comfortable. <laughs> Go on, open wide, and close, and open wide again, and close, and open wide again, and close, and then open wide, and close, and open wide, and close, and then wide, and close, good job. Didn't really work with mask, but watch out. Oh no. <laughs> Oh, yes. no. No, swing your chin left for me, so I go and right, and left, and right, and left, and right, and left. I'm going to move it this way. Open a little. Good. Open again, and then swing to the left, and the right, and the left, and the right. Yeah, smooth as you like. Awesome. Let's get your line on your front knee, face downwards. You're a natural, you see, is natural. <laughs> it's, all, it's all that practicing for the public. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> I've got to keep you going, you see. Mm -hmm. Right then, I'm short on the right hand side. Yeah, yeah, you are. <laughs> 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 you don't need to be a camera practice until you're short on the right. Yeah? And this one, pull towards you, let's see how strong you are on this one. Okay, there's this one here. Bend this one here again. It's right in there as well. Right, let's get you lying on this side for me, facing the beautiful boxes. <laughs> A little, pop that there for me. Right, there you go. Breath on it. Beautiful. Mm -hmm. We like to bring the oceans to us if we can. It's so, I mean, funny because like, me, and, me and Alicia, we just love like, the ocean so much. <laughs> and you know, you try to bring it <laughs> in. Exactly. Bring it as much as you can. I've got you there. Let's breathe out. Keep going, keep going. Beautiful. Let's get your life on your back for me, facing up and double check all of those. Make sure that you're nice and level. Right, hands together for me. Oh, spot on, isn't happy with that. Done. Perfect. Thank you very much.